Marilyn Buck Presente. For 30 long, torturous years, Marilyn Buck was a political prisoner, a captive of the federal prison system for her role in the freeing of former Black Panther Asada Shakur. She wrote gripping, radical poetry, often about the plight of her fellow prisoners, as well as prisoners who were active in the Black freedom and nationalist movements. For example, in 2000, she wrote Black August, a few words of which follow. Would you hang on a cliff's edge, sword sharp, slashing fingers, while jackboot screws stomp heels on peeled flesh bones and laugh? Let go, die, damn you, die. Could you hold on 20 years, 30 years? 20 years, 30 years, and more. Brave black brothers buried in U.S. concentration camps. They hang on, black light shining in torture chambers. Rochelle, Yogi, Sundiata, Sekou, Warren, Chip, Seth, Herman, Jaleel, and more and more they resist, Black August. Marilyn wrote that poem in 2000. She was released in July 2010 and recently passed away from the ravages of cancer. Buck was imprisoned for so long because of her support of the Black Liberation Movement, which made her a sort of traitor to the white nation. Like John Brown, she fought to free the unfree. Her spirit of resistance never left her. Marilyn was 62. From death row, this is Mumia Abu Jamal. These commentaries are recorded by Noel Hanrahan of Prison Radio.